Hello and welcome again to the Friday Wrap uh, for April 27th. I'm Mayor Mickey, and uh, you'll never guess uh, where I'm filming from right now, but you'll you'll hear but get to hear all about it when I'm done. Uh, the uh, uh, this week was a, a very busy week, starting with last uh, uh, last weekend. Uh, we, uh, Burr Ridge resident Sreen, Dr. Srini Reddy, who is the president of the Indian, Indian American Medical Association, uh, they invited me to a special dinner uh, banquet they had and a fundraising b banquet, an annual meeting for the IAMA uh, in, uh, over in Elmhurst. Uh, that was incredible. I probably ran into 15 or 20, maybe even 30 residents from Burr Ridge. Uh, that was a uh, really neat, uh, neat function, it happens every year, and as well as the, the big meeting, which will be coming up in the fall. Uh, the village board meeting this week, uh, most items were on the consent agenda, but it still took a, a few hours to discuss a number of other, a number of other items. Uh, for example, uh, the, uh, we, we talked about the Burr Ridge address system. Well, you know a lot of businesses in Burr Ridge and homes have, have this address of how many miles uh, from Chicago they are, from State Street, and you know, it goes 15W256, and et cetera. We're talking about exploring the possibility of, of uh, simplifying those for safety reasons um, as well as confusion. Uh, and uh, so that we're going to start to that, re that research uh, right away. We also talked about possibly having a balanced budget policy. Apparently, there's been a bunch of uh, confusion as to what really constitutes a balanced budget in, an, in a municipality, and uh, we have had one every year except for one in the last 20 years. But we want to have that as a definition so everybody knows what uh, fund accounting is all about. We also talked about strategic goals, and thanks to uh, uh, Louisa Hawk, our, one of our planning commissioners, and, and t trustee Tony Schiappa, uh, we also uh, are going to in institute some uh, bicycle safety awareness, and, and we have formed an actual committee. Uh, regarding that, so uh, for both cyclists as well as drivers. And then we went into closed session to discuss a number of different items. Uh, this week, I also had a tour of the, uh, the, the brand new opening uh, of the uh, Shirley Ryan Ability Lab that opened up on Monday. Uh, they offer three different types of programs, uh, fr from outpatient program, for, which is basically orthopedic, as well as uh, post-ops. They have day rehab, which is for brain injury and strokes and different neurological items or concerns as well as a physician practice. Uh, it's, it's amazing. They have 30 employees there. Uh, three quarters of their, of their patients actually are, 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 uh, come in via shuttle, you know, car or, or bus, uh, and uh, they have, have a separate entrance uh, just for that. But it's, a, it's, a, it's an incredible, incredible uh, building. Uh, they even have a staircase for, for rehab that actually leads up to a window. They call it the staircase to a view, and does have a very nice view of the, of the village. They are having a grand opening on May 5th. Uh, it's open to the public from 10 a.m. till 12 p.m. Uh, and uh, on a personal note, uh, this week you might see by the pictures, my daughter uh, went on her first uh, trip since uh, uh, celebrating her one-year anniversary of her, of, of her, of her being uh, employed uh, outside, of, outside of college. And uh, she's actually in, in Athens, Greece, as well as uh, Santorini, and then Rome, Italy, and then Venice. So that was quite an incredible trip for her. Now, where, as to where I'm at, I'd like to introduce you to Leslie Bowman, uh, and uh, this, uh, uh, where I'm located right now is at, at, at the Design Bar. You might not recall, they're, they're located currently in the middle of, uh, of the Village Center, but as of, uh, as of yesterday, they opened up a huge facility uh, over here by the Village Green. I'd like to introduce you to the owner, Leslie. Hello, Leslie. Hi, nice, nice to, to see meet you. <laughs> nice to see you again. Yeah, nice to see you. And uh, I hope you, I want you to have you say a few words about sure. the uh, about the store. It looks incredible. Thank you. Um, yeah. So we opened yesterday um, uh, to uh, seven thousand square foot showroom we have here. And so what this showroom does is highlight all the different I um, areas of interior design that we handle. So we have in the front furniture vignettes, um, which will highlight the different furniture that we have. And as you walk through the space, you'll be able to see different um, art gallery, a lighting gallery. Um, we'll have a whole design center that will take place um, open in the end of May that will highlight some different cabinet lines that we carry, four different lines of tile. Um, so really anything that you need for your home you can get here and we can help you with. And we're really excited to be down here in this great open space. So well, check this out. If you look over here to the to your right, uh, come over here come over here a second. Sure. The uh, now seven thousand square feet. Now, yep. uh, you mentioned earlier about uh, uh, people don't know that you're, you have, uh, you're multifaceted. Yep. Now, wh uh, what category does that fall under? 
Um, so we are a full service interior design firm. We focus mostly on residential, um, but we do do some commercial work as well. We've done restaurants, hotels, um, we've done stuff internationally, um, and we can really kind of help with any sort of project that anybody might have. Um, some office work as well that we've done. We've done uh, the lobbies of some of the condo buildings here in the Village Center as well. Um, so really anything that you can imagine <laughs> we can pretty much take care of so we do custom bedding window treatments we have a whole tabletop section um, and we also have some great stuff for the summer so you mentioned the village green and that you know we have the concerts here so we have some great picnic wear some mm. great um, plastic paper wear and stuff like that which will be um, great coolers um, that people can stop in and get um, for the uh, concerts great. and stuff yeah great well this is fantastic and also uh, the design bar now really anchors this whole area uh, down here. Maybe at the beginning of uh, maybe maybe all be filling up. It's a great location, especially if uh, someone's uh, uh, coming here to uh, for the for one of the concerts. Uh, but regardless, I hope you make a special trip. I always like to plug our local businesses, and this is a, I'm very, we're very proud of this one and glad that they're here. Matter of fact, so is uh, all of the uh, uh, all of the, the entire area. They were featured in the Hinsdale Living Magazine, including like uh, ten pages uh, of uh, of talking about their 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 store. So. Looks beautiful. Thank you very much Thank for joining you. me. Thanks for yeah. having me. Thanks for coming. Thanks again. All Appreciate right. it. Thanks. Thanks again. That's a wrap.